Hi, I'm Jojo Astro Barbie, Fairy of Love. Welcome to the weekly horoscope of this beautiful summer. This week, the sun is in the sun of Leo, so happy birthday to you. Kings and queens of the zodiac, we love you. The moon will travel in the signs of Libra, Scorpio, Sagittarius, and Capricorn. On Monday, Venus, goddess of love, in mental, chatty, intellectual Gemini, will enter a very loving, sensitive, sentimental Cancer until the end of August, all the way through September, opening up our hearts and making us feel things deeply. It really calls for us to really love and share our feeling and express how we love everybody and everything, and this is the month to do this. The focus will be on empowering women, the woman power, divine feminine, children, real estate, poetry, romance, and also enjoying life. Everything to do with life and poetry and feeling things deeply. That's the whole week. Thursday, Uranus, planet of change and shock, will go retrograde for a long time. And that's a good thing because retro Uranus is cuckoo. When it goes uh, frontwards, it just makes chaos everywhere. And it's, it just pushes everything to change and to look at the things hiding under things in order to get to the truth to clean the air. And we'll calm the chaos that we've been living in the beginning of this year, everywhere a little bit, in our country, in our personal life. It will calm that chaos a bit down, allowing us to rethink old beliefs, old ways of doing things, and free ourselves from very negative or destructive behavior that no longer work for us. And it's a very good time to make amends, to correct, to repair, to make things right in world, political affairs, and also in our personal life. And you will see a tendency to do so. But scandals still continue to remain. We're getting closer and closer to the truth. And at the end of the day, uh, the end of the year will be very nice, especially after the eclipse on the 21st of August. Trust me, that eclipse will sort of, a, we will be able to say after that, <sighs> I think we're gonna be okay, and we will. On Friday, Lucky Jupiter will square Pluto. That's not good, it's sort of harsh aspect. It will sort of be quite negative on the financial sector. So if you're an investor, you're doing anything with Wall Street, anything with gambling, anything with investing, double check everything in detail because now we're starting a strange period starting Friday of this week, this coming week. Uh, with the eclipse after that on the 7th of August and another one on the 21st of August. So you have to really, really, really be smart. Any investor, just don't go and show yourself there because it could be some changes, rapid changes all over the place, okay? Even with all those new currencies. So double check everything. So what you think may end up being completely the contrary, so you have to be watching your books in a very detailed manner for at least, I would say, uh, first week of September. It's a very good time also to be patient, to be diligent, to pay attention, and also resist the urge to use force and to force our way through to keep, to get things done. It's very, very important also to be flexible and also to uh, keep our eyes open on the bigger picture, okay, of the greater purpose of it all. And always follow our hearts and do things with kindness and love, especially with Venus and Cancer. Okay, let me start with Leo. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Get ready for an inspiring week. You start like reborn again. Venus, planet of love entering your spiritual sector, bring you more freedom of action and peace of mind. The focus is on romance, creativity, and the ability to express your feelings. At work, you attract success and applause. Women inspire you a lot. Somehow, you also have a good relationship with um, children and animals and nature. On the weekend, love is definitely in the air. It's time to, to express your feelings and make up. If you did something wrong somewhere, just catch up and make up and say, I'm sorry. Let's go back together again, something like that. And forgive the past, make a fresh start because you are reborn again this year, this week. Your magical color orange, like numbers 742. 
But here it goes. Venus, planet of love, entering your social sector, bringing you hope and blessings in finances, in love. Your personal life is better and better, and you're taking good care of yourself, especially in health. You appreciate also your possessions. It makes you more secure. In love, definitely, you could have a deja vu experience, something from the past that you experienced before that comes back that makes you think. It makes you wiser. Money picture is bright, but it's time to more for saving than spending. And in career, you handle everything like a pro. And on the weekend, friendship definitely plays key role. Your magical color pink, like in number six and 49. Libra, Venus planet of love entering your career sector bring you beauty. It also brings you creativity and more flow in your life. Peace and serenity is definitely what you need. You could be working on a new deal, a new project that could bring big money in the future. Take the breaths often this week. Go slowly. In career, other people may also give you a hand or be, uh, become a partner of something big that will happen in the future. Still, it's very important to stick to your guns and to do things your way. Listen, but follow your gut. Give what you can, but learn to say no if needed when it comes to feelings and love. And in finances, past decisions that you've made before are starting to pay off. On the weekend, you'll be getting some visits from people that you like, and it's a good time to talk business and also to talk love. So whatever is love or business, enjoy. You're the queen, you're absolutely the queen of the party or the king of the party somehow. Your magical color, gold lucky numbers five and 41. Scorpios, Venus planet of love entering your karmic sector brings sensitivity, good judgment, wisdom, generosity of heart, a good time to beautify your surroundings, participate in group activities and make travel plans or go and visit some friends. Whatever you do, it will be so satisfying. Focus on your goals, on your plan, on your career plans, on your health. Where do you want to be in a year from now? Okay, you want to be just speak and spell gorgeous and beautiful and perfect and full of abundance and doing what you love in career. Whatever now is the time to really look at your ducks and put them in the row. The action is definitely uh, best for you in the middle of the week where you will feel totally confident with yourself. On the weekend, relax, pamper yourself and also get in touch with people you haven't seen for a long time. It would be fun. Some of you may even go and visit somebody and it will make you feel good. Your magical color red, like in number six and 36. Ta-da! Sagittarius, Venus, planet of love entering your shared resources sector, make you popular, smart, lucky, and creative. You are protected and have all the tools you need to succeed. So what are you waiting for? In career, you get a big boost. A co-worker also, or associate or friend can also open up new doors for you that could really, really bring new opportunities. A loved one also could share a secret that will really inspire you. And on the weekend, celebrate your good fortune because you are lucky. Your magical color, fuchsia, lucky numbers, five and 41. Ta-da! Capricorn, Venus planet of love entering your relationship sector, give you wings and power. You want to be in love if you're single. And guess what? Love is in the air. You could fall in love, meet somebody. You have a very big heart and make a very big difference all week long. Everywhere you go, people say thank you for being there. The public also applauds you very much. So in social and career life, you are definitely doing better than you thought in some kind of, kind of negotiations. And in love, you are definitely admired and respected. Spend quality time with family and friends. They need you now, on the weekend especially. Family and friends. If you're single, oh my God, definitely a possibility of meeting somebody. Wow. Your magical color, yellow lucky number six and 24. Aquarius, Venus planet of love entering your work sector, make you very smart, alert, and very brilliant, innovative. You mean this planet of change, your ruler of innovation, going backwards, finally will smooth things down very much in your health, your relationship, your career. You're definitely more in peace. And also it's time to exude universal appeal in career. People are watching you. The focus is also doing things differently, experimenting, letting go of relationship that doesn't go anymore and getting involved in new situation to reinvent yourself. What works for you, you keep. What you, that doesn't work for you. Or anybody that took advantage of you in the past, bye. Study, seminars, workshop, travel, 
all favored. Also investment, very good except for Friday. And on the weekend, you definitely enjoy great company. You are very famous all weekend. Your magical color, pink lucky number seven and 43. Pisces, Venus planet of love entering your creative sector brings inspiration and also solutions to some dilemmas you had. Keep an open mind and go with the flow. You may ask yourself many questions about the purpose of your life and financially trust your hunches. People also come to you for advice and support. And of course you say yes and it makes a difference. Somehow you touch people's heart very deeply this week, so thank you for being there. And on the weekend, let your imagination float and your dreams could be prophetic. Your magical color violet, lucky numbers, 7, 25. Aries, Venus splendid of love entering your home sector, bring inner peace, positive thoughts, and also a love surprise. The focus is on partnerships and also uh, making very good in your personal and professional life. It's like balanced. You attract deep feelings and sincerity in your relationships. Long-term investments and long-term commitments uh, are definitely favored. And you could be locating maybe a needed material or some financial support for a project. It's like you have a blessing or somebody saying yes. You could also be reconnected with someone you haven't seen for a long, long time and it will make you happy. On the weekend, open your heart, share your joy, be confident, only positive thoughts, right? Your magical color, red, lucky numbers two and 11, ta-da! Taurus, Venus, planet of love. Venus is your ruler and it's planet of love in your communication sector, bring you a love of luck in real estate, investments, and finances. Yes, you could make more money in the next couple of months. Some of you could even hit like millionaire maybe. Getting a new house, new car, all that stuff is fabulous. Do not commit yet though too fast. Do everything slowly and just follow your hunches. Think things through, okay? See things in the bigger picture, how it progresses, ask questions, make your research, and you will hit the jackpot. If the chances are by the next couple of months, you will be in a very powerful position. Are you ready for that, Taurus? That's your destiny. Good connections also you made earlier in the year can help you also to succeed in a project. In love, you feel appreciated. And the weekend, group conversations and food and good wine definitely on your menu. Your magical color green, lucky numbers 5 and 41. Gemini, Venus, planet of love entering your financial sector enhances your business skills and negotiating powers. A good time to get in touch with your higher self. Reflect and evaluate what you want to do with your life. You feel closer to your mate, your family, your friends, and legal matters need attention in career and play by the rules. Very important. If you're honest and you play by the rules, you're going to succeed big time. If not, it will fire back, especially with Uranus going backwards. In love, somehow it's time to express your feelings and, you, and show your gratitude for people who have been good to you. On the weekend, it brings spiritual answers, yoga, massage, taking care of your beauty are favored, your magical color, orange, and lucky numbers, four and 22. Cancer, cancer, that's me, yuppie, Venus, planet of love, entering your sun. Wow, what a blessing. It brings charm, beauty, magnetism, popularity. And for some people, miracles in healing, in some project, a good time to express your super creativity and to share your love. There's a new exciting energy in the air. Things are just moving quickly. It's like you are pulled in a new, exciting, unexpected direction. Do not resist, just accept the invitation. The universe is calling you. You say, yes, I'm here, I'm showing up. Follow your hunches that could help you really make the right decisions in health and career and love. And in love, please share your thoughts and your feelings. People want to know and they want to be loved by you. On the weekend, your mind and emotions are in perfect zinc. What a perfect time to show and express your love. Like everywhere you go, just say, I love you, I love you, I love you. And people will say, I love you back. You're going to be like a ball of snow of, of love. Isn't that beautiful? Your magical color pink lucky number 6 and 33. ta -da! And now here's your wizard affirmation of this extraordinary, interesting week, to say the least. You know what is the magic word for happiness and the key to paradise? Acceptance. Acceptance of who you are, of other people the way they are, or what is, is the key to peace and happiness. 
Acceptance is the key that opens all doors, the key to paradise and the key to allow the universe to do its thing and not interfere and bless it all. Acceptance. Try it. You will love it. Love you guys. Enjoy Venus and Cancer. Oh, express your love. Just tell everybody, I love you, I love you, I love you. I do that all the time. Try it. You will like it. And everybody likes it. Bye.